it's Linda. Today I wanted to share my first fun schooling math workbook, Counting to 30, Number Games, Mazes, Edition, Math Stories, Coloring, and Drawing. It's such a cute picture right here. It's about so thick. And it says, this book includes Counting to 30, Number Writing, Spelling of Numbers, Math Stories, Edition Games, Shapes, days of the week, months of the year, mazes, and number games. And then here we have a cute little dragon there. And then we already read that on the back of the book. Learning is fun with the Thinking Tree books. And over here it says instructions. Read the words on each page with your child. Ask the children to repeat after you. Count together. Use colored pencils, gel pens, and fine point mechanical pencils to complete the writing and coloring activities. Some of the writing pages, oops, I lost my, um, some of the writing activities, teach your child to write tiny numbers. Be sure to use a sharp pencil or mechanical pencil for best results. Your children should be able to use logic to figure out what to do on each page. Feel free to complete some of the first few writing activities while your child watches. Young children need to see your example before they begin writing. Helping your child is an excellent way to teach them the skills they need to read, write, and calculate. If any of the activities are too difficult for your child, they can watch you complete the page. Talk about what you both are learning. Please note that we introduced two different ways to draw number numbers four and one. Please explain to your child that there is often more than one correct way to do many things. This is a valuable life lesson. So here is one. Right here says there are two ways to make a one. What do you like best? And it has one little kitten. And it has them tracing and then writing on their own the two. A little bit of math right there. Three. And then here's the fours. A little bit of math right there. It's so cute. Drawing time. And they could also listen to um, music and audiobook while they do that. Maze. Write the missing numbers. Color one, two, three, four, and five. And they go on to six, seven, and then they got seven days. And these are great to use with gel pens right here. Eight, and there's a math problem at the bottom. This is so cute with the bees. And you can also um, use manip manipulative, you know, like little blocks and things like that. And do one plus one and then have them, the blocks or little counters, or beans, whatever, noodles. And then right here, we're going to kind of review. And we got 10. And then there's their math challenge. Drawing time in a maze. That's cute. Write the missing numbers. Write the missing numbers. 11. And 12 months. Once they get to number 12, 13, Cute little zebras. Oh, I like these. Right here are some shapes. You can go over the shapes. Math challenge. Wow, now we're on 20. Drawing time, another maze. All right, the missing numbers. Twenty plus three. And you can end up spending um, several days on, you know, this page. 
um, by showing them with six plus six with some objects. Maybe they only write a few of these, just depending on the age and ability of your child. There are 26 letters in the alphabet. 28 butterflies. And here we are, 30. There's the math challenge. I'll write the missing numbers. I'll write the missing numbers. And that's the end of the book. Thank you so much for watching. Y'all have a great day.